There's a chainsaw in the safety box. He's putting a new chain on it because the old one is blunt. This is his workshop. Amazing. He's going to test it now. He really knows what he's doing. This is so great. Looks like it works. A short stop at one of my favorite shops, the bakery. This is a pain au chocolat, but like with bread. It's a very heavy pain au chocolat, which is exactly what I got. So, oh, this is such a cool place. I love it. Ciao! So, this is the pain au chocolat. You can't see the chocolate coming out of the side, but it's in there. A bread of chocolate. And I also got a bread of cheese, of course. My favorite. It is close shoe weather. Isn't that sad? Definitely autumn. So I've just had a lovely day in Lubomats. I got a chain for the chainsaw. That makes me so happy because now uh, Asim or I can cut up the rest of the wood and it'll go away quicker because last time the chain was so blunt, the poor guy was really struggling. So I'm walking towards the back of the house, which not really the back, more like the east side. And this is the wood that needs chopping. And there's still a whole nother heap. Um, let me show you actually. It's Maggie. <laughs> She's always with me. Mau, mau, mau. She's next to the metal actually. Hey, cat. Hey, pretty. What you doing, Ray? What you doing? <laughs> meow, meow, meow. It's actually still quite warm. So I put an extra spot on in her neck. I don't know if you can see that. It's a bit dusty there where dust got stuck to the spot on <laughs> but it's better to have a little spot on versus fleas so look isn't that beautiful oh. cosmos makes me so happy it's incredible i think just having lemongrass cosmos and then <laughs> a gigantic butternut and of course a smudgy isn't that amazing look at this lovely new canna Yes, smudgy, it is a pretty good canna, isn't it? It's a good canna. Yeah, good canna. I think this canna looks very, very good where it is. I can't wait to see the flower. I think it's going to be a red flower, but let's see. So here we are next to the garage, next to the driveway. This is the small wood pile. It was as tall as the little wall here, and Asim demolished it with the blunt chain so he worked really really hard and there's some more wood so much wood i'm not complaining but it's it's a lot of wood <laughs> it's just a lot of work i'm really happy to have it and yeah it's just really good to have because chopped wood prices have really shot up so i'm super grateful to have all this junk wood that i get to burn in the wood burner really really happy about that you can see some more wood over there but that's not for burning those are very very good or at least they look good to me right now they might not be good in the end but they look like I can use them for maybe um, I don't know a trellis maybe a trellis I'm hoping because or you know what would be even better is to build a little garage for Jade. I know she's got this amazing walnut tree over there. 
<laughs> but just imagine if I can get her a little garage or a sunshade. I think she'd really appreciate that. So I might be able to do that at some point. I don't think those beams are actually long enough. It would have to be three meter beams because she is two and a half meters tall. I'm just here by the cherry tree. Look at this. There's a lot of sap coming out of this tree. I don't know. It's not focusing. There, can you see the sap? This is a cherry tree. Oh wow, that is a lot of cherry tree sap and there's some more over here. I wonder why that's happening. I didn't cut these branches re uh, at all. They were cut last year, so... Well, they might have been cut longer ago, but definitely not any time recently. There's a lot of sap.